Today's case is the vowel sound R in the nasal finals. To keep things simple, I'll be using the English names for the spelling letters. This vowel sound R appears in two nasal combinations, AN, UAN. Both are front nasals. There is no back nasal combination for this R. Why? Because it's easy. It's the principle of least effort is manifesting its power here. This R is a front vowel, so it's easier for it to reach the front nasal consonant. And it leaves the job of gliding into the back nasal consonant to its back vowel counterpart. First, let's construct the sound of AN in two steps. Step one, we produce the front R, uh, easy, no tricks. This is probably the most common sounds in all languages. Step two, from here, we glide into mm, so like this. Um, um, so final, and that's our target sound. If you're looking for a reference point, this sound matches well with the female given name, and in both the French and the British pronunciations. However, the Chinese AN is different from the American AN because they have two different vowel sounds. The Chinese AN is A, ah, so it's AN. The American AN is A, ah, is AN. Now, after you have mastered the AN, AN, we move on to the UAN. To construct UAN sound, we just add a semi-vowel in the beginning, like this, and one. A remark here, the semi-vowel it serves as the onset and it should glide into the R seamlessly. We should not hear a gap between these two sounds. If it sounds like an, an, it's not right. It should be one, one, it's very smooth. Now you have it. This is your Chinese case consultant, Triple C. Bring me a case by asking me a question. If I open your case, I will close it for you.